So the Facebook Oversight Board will make that determination. As you know, uh, no Twitter, no Instagram, no Facebook for Mr. Trump. He's banned because of the Capitol insurrection. They laid that on him. Now, um, President of the United States banned from social media, that's a big deal. You would think, what does BLM have to do with Facebook allowing Donald Trump back on social media? What? What? Oh, here you go. So Black Lives Matter Global Network is a Marxist organization. They admit it, okay? They give orders to the local chapters of BLM because the Black Lives Matter Global Foundation has $100 million, mostly corporate donations. So Black Lives Matter puts out a threat to Facebook a demand, which is really a threat. And the threat is that Donald Trump is to be banned from social media forever and for running for political office again. Okay, this is what Black Lives Matter puts out publicly, publicly. All right. So they want, this is their demand. Now, if you don't give in to that demand, The implication is Black Lives Matter is going to come after you. That's what this is all about, the suppression of information. We see it in the cancel culture. We see it in the corruption of the corporate media. Are they going to report this story about Black Lives Matter demanding that Trump be banned forever from social media and never be able to run again for anything? Are they? No. They know about it. I know about it. Everybody in the press knows about it. They're not going to report it. 